Hey guys, welcome back. Um, today, give you a little update. Haven't had much time to work on the Z. I've done a little things here and there after work, but really not much progress. Hopefully today we'll get to take off the carbs, clean up the engine bay a little bit, um, try to touch up some of the areas I want to repaint, and then go from there. So what I have done is taken off the heat shield, um, I've loosened up all the bolts that go around the header and the intake, taking those bolts off. Um, the carb's still not coming off yet. I got a few more to squeeze in and take off, and then hopefully that should make, should allow us to take it off, um, start cleaning up a little bit. Touch, like I said, touch up the areas that I want to touch up and then hopefully work on getting the new carbs on. All right, got the carb on finally. I struggled for a little bit. This bolt right here, where the nut was stuck on the stud and it was taking the stud out and there's not a lot of clearance here. As you can see, it was just getting stuck. So I couldn't get it off, finally got it off. We'll have to get a new gasket, clean all this up, take the header completely off. Looking better. Now we're just going to seal up the ports and make sure nothing gets in there um, while we're cleaning up some of the old gasket material that's here. Get rid of this, clean it up, sand it off, um, throw another coat of paint just to cover the areas that need to be touched up, and then continue working. One of the extras, one of the things I want to clean up is getting rid of this auxiliary vacuum line that goes from the gas tank to the old carbs. The new carbs that I'm getting don't actually need that. So we're gonna get rid of this bracket, this whole line, take off the clips, and then, yeah, mainly just get, get rid of the line, just clean it up, make it look a little cleaner. Um, this has to stay here for the proportioning for the brakes. Getting free. So we have another bracket here. Oops. At some point in time, if you guys can see, there's some wrinkles in here. So, car was definitely hit in the front. Some wrinkles in here too, but had the alignment done on it, it actually drives pretty straight. So it's not a big deal. I'm not building a show car. Just want to have a fun weekend driver. Um, this is how it kind of looks now without the extra rail here. Um, I also took off the coil for now just to repaint this, touch it up, and then took it off from there. Now I'm undoing these little clips. To take out the extra wire. 
This goes to the windshield washer tank, which I currently do not have in the car. It just broke off. So, some of the stuff is super brittle. It has not been changed. It is original to the car. Okay, so this side looks a lot better. I have all that cleaned up. Got the wiring out of there. The, got the shift cable loose or throttle cable loose. Got all the wires from here, working our way in here. Now we're gonna take off the battery. And I really wanna clean up a lot of the wiring that's in here. I installed a relay for the starter um, because on the early Zs, the starter goes through the ignition switch and if you put a relay it takes the pressure off of it and just gives it a little bit more cranking power easier to start so ended up doing this I'm gonna take all this off try to clean it up so that we can repaint it and then we'll keep going got to get rid of these cables redo it make it a little cleaner I got the fuel filter off with the fuel pressure regulator. Got the lines off. Undid the bolts down here. They're gonna hold the fuel line in. Um, just taking all the stuff out now. It's on the same little clips that go up and then the lines come out. So we have a lot of the stuff taken apart now. We got everything taken off on this side. Harness is out of the way. Batteries out. Few lines are out. The nuts are off to clean that up. So we'll start sanding and do a little touch of paint. Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, little update. Kept working off camera for a little bit, but I got some primer on, um, taped off certain stuff that I had wanted on. It's gonna be repainted black, so I didn't do a very clean job of painting, of taping everything off, but got, got it covered in primer, let it dry, and then we'll end up putting some black paint on here, just so it's all the same again. I've done, here's a little update. I ended up painting the whole engine bay lost black, and then I put on a 2K clear. Came out pretty good. It's not perfect, but it looks way better. So nice and clean, a lot better than the matte finish that I had on here before. Oh man, this is gonna look so good. Once it's up and running, but it's, it's nice and clean. So I didn't put the new gasket on or anything yet. I just wanna mock it up where they're gonna go because I'm gonna try to get the fuel system running here on the, on the firewall. And I just wanna make sure it lines up nice and neat with the carbs. That's going to be good. <laughs> 